What's up, family? I came across a clip of Bill Burr from a TV series called Immoral Compass. Let me just say, Bill Burr is a national treasure. Bill will say the things that other people are thinking and sometimes say things that you never even thought about and he knows how to put it in perspective. I tell you all the time that evil people run the world. Bill was able to brilliantly articulate why. In this show, he said that if you feel guilt, don't feel bad. That's actually a good thing. That means that you're a good person. He said that, you know, it's okay to, you know, not like yourself because, you know, sometimes you say yes when you mean no. Or you say no when you really meant yes, so you, you'd be mad at yourself. And he continued by saying that, these psychopaths, the psychos, they run the world because they don't feel guilt. The good people can't defeat the psychos because they walk around with guilt. They don't want to feel guilty. So the psychos win. He said the psychos would kill anybody. The good people don't, the good people should be doing the same thing to the psychos, but the psychos get over because the good people are have a, a feeling of guilt. Right on the money. Right on the money. But let me tell you something about me, fam. I consider myself a good person. I don't bother anybody unless they bother me. You love me, I love you. You hate me, I hate you. And that's regardless of background, ethnicity, gender, age, whatever. I don't care about your, you know, what the religion is. I don't consider none of that. If you love me, I love you. If you hate me, I hate you. And fam, if you do to me, I am going to do to you. I don't care about all of that other stuff. All of that, well, you know, do unto others if you had them to do unto you. No, I'm going to do unto others as they do unto me. Anybody else? See, if you can't live with it, that's on you. But I'm not letting anybody run over me and mine. I'm not having it. I'm not, I'm not having it at all. And I ain't got no problem down in a psycho. That's right. I feel nothing. I feel nothing. I'm going to give them what they give me. They don't feel any guilt. It's like if somebody tried to break in my house, I'm going to give them everything they're looking for because when they come into my house, they already know that it's a chance that I could be in there. So they don't care about me and my, or it, they don't care about the safety of me or my family. They come in there oftentimes armed with the idea that if they encounter somebody on the other side and they meet resistance, that they are going to down them. So why shouldn't I have that same mentality? And I'm not asking for permission. That was really a rhetorical question. I know what to do. I'm going to get with them. I'm not playing no games. I'm going to give them exactly what they would give me. They ain't got no regard for my health and safety, my life. I, I feel the exact same way. So it would be nice if everybody felt that way. And like Bill said, if we did, we wouldn't have this big old mass of trash the size of Texas in the ocean, in the middle of the ocean. Because the good people would do whatever it takes to make sure that that type of stuff wouldn't happen in the first place. You see it all the time. You see these 
weak politicians allowing stuff to go down and they act like they got all the power until it's time for the wicked to exercise their wicked ways. I'm not with none of that. Do unto others as they do unto you. And the trip part about it is only a few of the wicked people that are at the top, but they have so much power that they're able to hold everybody else off. Everybody just afraid of that little power that they have. Uh, I'm not with it. If he breathe, he bleed. That's right, I said it. If he breathe, he bleed. I 100% feel what Bill Burr is saying. Basically, he's saying that it's okay to have a conscience, but if you want to free the world, you're going to have to put that conscience on hold for a bit. John Mayer had a song called Waiting on the World to Change. Great song, but perhaps John didn't get the memo because the world is changing. The problem is because good people fail to confront evil people. It's changing for the worst. No more talk.